one moment I reset my stats and try to look at it again yes we can go to simulation reset node status click this way yes and after that after that go yes okay uh, we can see one we need to do one thing uh, if we will look at the tool pass it uses the radius compensation it can be switch off inside the inside this window well go this way and switch off the compensation well that's all calculating look at it again that is good for us well uh, the next thing we would like to make the takeover and uh, machine this part uh, in the right spindle so create new auxiliary operation um, Russian names mm, uh, takeover to the opposite spindle calculating well, look at it. Well, it's good. Uh, so after that, we would like to machine the profile using live contouring operation again. Yes, the position of the zero is also changed. We will define the tool define the tool uh, current tool holder position right left id uh, change the tool to the left yes so now tool is good for us and so we would like to machine this line add the profile so in this where we can see that there is no cut in this area so I can use any vertical cut uh, in this way I just add this surface make it visible and move it to the any place I change the side of the machining and mm, something strange we can use undo yes select it and Okay, and uh, set this value to example seven, and set set engage. And uh, retract. Well, that is good for us. So we take the profile and edit it. 
After that, uh, click properties, set the change the cycle type, uh, go to parameters of the cycle, set it to Excel radial, so set the step, remove the and switch off the finish pass. Okay. Well, so this part is defined. The next, uh, I would like to outside writing operation. Select writing cycle, cycle and uh, define the define the site of the machining, make the first invisible, define the site of the machining, we can, sorry, okay, well we can see some problems inside this uh, profile uh, and we can e edit and remove it inside our part right here. I just select all these elements, click control and select it. And I remove all these elements. And after that I select this point and insert rounding. Define the rounding size and that's good. Now I can see one arc in this place. Well, calculating the tool pass and look at our part machining. Go to the first operation. So we can see everything. Grooving, drilling, inside grooving, take over, well that is all, thank you for your attention, bye.